Yo, what up, what up? So I'm still playing Triple Threat offline trying to get, well, not anymore, Dick Barnett, but also Rudy LaRusso, and I'm getting all of the uh, mystery packs while I'm at it, but the dick is now mine. Insert disgusting comments below. So yes, I'm still chasing Rudy. So, so far during this event, I have got Spencer Haywood twice. If you do watch a gentleman on YouTube called Kilzamoa, he does suggest Mel Daniels because Mel Daniels has a massive arm length. So the guy is really, really good if you like to run the 2-3 zone defense. He's only six foot nine. We, we can take a quick look at him. I'll just back out of this really, really quickly. I always say that, and it's never quick. Hey, the women disagree. But uh, where is he? Mel Daniels. So when hey, this card's fairly old, when you look at him, you're like, no big deal. 69220, super short for a center, obviously, but and still kind of short for power forward. But his wingspan is like seven foot four or seven foot eleven. It's something ridiculous for his height. And he is a 4017. But uh here we are to come to look at the dick. Oh, and I remember, yes, now when Dick Barnett came out. Also did Terry Cummings. So if you're all about the uh, sexual innuendos, that was the whole thing for that. <laughs> what is up with these guys' pictures? His face just looks, I'll just say, unnatural. So shooting guard, point guard, 6'4", 190. So not great on the height, but free is amazing. 45 and 9. We'll scroll through this. Pause if you need to check anything else specifically. Back in the day when this came out, probably two months ago, it had all the badges you needed. It definitely doesn't compete with some of the cards that come out now. But again, every Opal is still generally usable. Unless all you do is unlimited, all of these cards are usable for absolutely every other game mode. <coughs> Don't worry, that's the COVID cough. So the only thing he lacks in there was the rebounding, because again, it's a height thing. Scroll through the tendencies. There was also something I noticed in the auction market earlier. And I am getting close to a thousand tokens. I may just end up opening up that thousand token pack. The one that's Giannis. Uh, Anthony Edwards and Richard. I really want Giannis, but I would flip Richard for some MT. If you end up getting 800k or 500k, that still can get you some 5 to 8 decent enough opals. But I would keep you honest. Because right now at this point in the year. I'm just going after cards I want. I don't like unlimited. I don't need the goat everything. I'll take all the free goats. Maybe a year from now when the game's completely dead. Because I refuse to buy this game again. And I'll touch on that for several reasons. One, the product's not that great. But unfortunately it's the only... Uh, NBA game in the market, so they pretty much have sealed that up. But uh, how can you do the defending NBA champions this dirty? Like, seriously, I haven't seen a new card of theirs since Marcus All or DeMar, whichever was first. I think it's Mark. Look into this. Okay, so DeMar, none of those are new ish. Kyle Lowry, I guess, would be around the same time as Marcus Gasol. But, like, the bench? Come on. Come on. Norm Powell was putting it on, like, three weeks. The whole three weeks before the season was on hiatus. Like, give the team some respect. 
I guess Pascal would be fairly new too. But beyond that, those are pretty old cards. But uh, one thing I did notice in the auction mart, if you're trying to complete collections, this must be one of the prizes in the mystery packs. Because this was 100000 the other day. Look at those values. Look at those values. See if he's any cheaper. So eight grand is kind of where he's sticking at right now. It's 74. Pretty sure that's all mystery packs. So what I will do is I will open up the mystery packs. And I did end up actually purchasing Manupol. Mystery packs have never served me well, but it looks like I'm getting a card immediately. So this could be a lot of the Frostbite set, actually. I think they're just trying to dump the, the values of it, which I fell for. We're still looking for Opal Glow. Steve, right, too. I had 40k this morning, but I ended up spending a lot. What we got going on here? I feel like this is a complete Frostbite set. Scotty Pippen? Yeah, of course. So if you're doing the collecting of any set, get on the Frostbites right now. Now I feel kind of bad for buying multiple Manu Bowls. Damn! But in buying Manu Bowl, what that did mean was I completed the Frostbite set. And this is the reward card. From the Utah Jazz standing in its 7 foot... I want to say two, but it could be seven foot three or seven foot four. We have center power forward Mark Eaton. So this is definitely one of the older Opals. So it's nothing special at all. It's funny because this morning I needed, I thought I needed some centers, even though I have like Hakeem and I don't know, a couple other people, Marcus Saul, Mikhail, et cetera, et cetera. And now I've just racked them all up. But let's take a look at Mark Eaton. I'm hoping he gets redone, much like the Opal Dwight Howard. And much like they did to the Opal Brandon Roy, where you get the Evo. Because he was at 23 and 21 before, I do believe. And now that's a very, very good card. But Mark Eaton here, seven foot four, so he tall, two seventy five, so he thick, long and thick, eighteen and nine, so yeah, the badges are pretty disgusting. I have a feeling though, if everything's going to be of the Frostbite collection, he will get an evolution pretty quick here, or maybe a duo, because I mean eighteen and nine. At this time of the year, isn't even a ruby, even though they don't make ruby cards. But I mean, diamonds are coming in with 35 Hall of Fame badges. So I'm not going to put a shoe on him for a while. I'm just going to kind of see where it goes. The only thing I don't like about tendencies. It takes a long time to scroll through them. If there is an evolution, I might revisit this later. Because you know it's going to be score 50 in a game evolution. But like I said, I suspect that's what they're leading towards, but there's absolutely no confirmation. This is just a gut feeling I'm having this very second. But 
But yeah, these stats. Wowzers. Wowzers. But at any rate, it is done. So I just got myself two brand new Galaxy Opals. Some length and dick. So uh, yeah, keep that grind game strong.